Whitefish Bay ends 2022 with a homicide. An 18 year old woman shot to death near her home. She was found on the sidewalk on Anita Avenue just north of Hampton. 12 News Nick Bohr live at the scene now and Nick state agents were on the scene throughout the morning. All right, that victim found here at 245 this morning, right here on the sidewalk. As you mentioned, the Department of Justice was called in here to assist Whitefish Bay police. And as you mentioned, those agents could still be seen out on the scene here late into the morning processing evidence. Witnesses tell 12 News off camera they heard four or five shots that one person described as a loud banging noise. They didn't realize it was a shooting until police arrived moments later and shut down the entire area. Police say she was shot multiple times and despite their efforts she died at the scene. Manual dispatcher had multiple gunshot wounds. I got two gunshot wounds to the, to the abdomen. Make that three. Caller stated that the shots came from a dark colored SUV. That was the only description we had. Looking for a dark colored SUV. Drove northbound on Anita. Another witness I talked to off camera said that SUV actually circled back and fired additional shots into the victim before driving off. We're not naming the victim. However, we've learned she was on probation for a felony narcotics possession conviction back in August and was awaiting trial on felony possession with intent to deliver marijuana charges in Fond du Lac County. Syria. Well, Nick, what are police saying about their search for the shooter or shooters? Well, I know so far they haven't made any arrests, though they did call this, quote, an isolated incident in a statement. They said that as well, they do not believe there is an ongoing threat to the community. That is their way of saying that they do believe this was a targeted attack. Nick Borg reporting live for us. Thank you, Nick.